let's talk about something called an antigen found on red blood cells. Before I start talking about the different types of blood, let's learn what an antigen and antibody is. On red blood cells, there are markers called antigens. These antigens help your immune system identify cells that are yours and cells that are foreign. Now, these antigens can be found on other types of cells and pathogens. However, your immune system still uses these antigens to figure out what cells are trying to infect you. Antibodies are proteins made by your immune system that attack these antigens. These antibodies also help identify foreign cells so your immune system can properly fight an infection. Now, when looking at the human blood types, there are three different alleles that code for these antigens. The A allele will code for an A antigen, the B allele will code for a B antigen, and the O allele will not code for an antigen. Now, I'm not going to go too far into the O blood because technically there still are antigens on the O blood, but for the basic knowledge that we have to know here, O blood doesn't have antigens. If you have A blood, your blood cells are covered in this A antigen. However, you also produce these B antibodies. These B antibodies will react with B blood. If you have B blood, you have a different set of antigens on your cells, but you also produce A antibodies. These A antibodies will attack A blood. If you have AB blood, you have both A and B antigens. However, you don't produce any antibodies. That's because if you produce these antibodies, these proteins would attack your own blood, and that's not good. If you have O blood, you don't have any of these antigens, but you produce both types of antibodies. So type O blood is called the universal donor since the blood cells don't have any antigens for the immune system to react with. And AB blood is the universal receiver since it doesn't have any antibodies to attack foreign blood with. You can see in our chart here at the top that O blood can donate to any type of blood while AB blood can receive from any type of blood. If you have A blood, you can donate to somebody who has A or AB. If you have B blood, you can donate to somebody who has B or AB. What can happen if you receive from somebody with the wrong type of blood is your antibodies will react with their antigens of the red blood cells and your blood will coagulate and that can cause some major problems and even death. So it's really important that you receive and give blood to the right person so this coagulation and these major problems won't happen.